All right, gang, so we are currently off to the FBE studios, and we're gonna be filming a bunch of reaction videos. Yep, that's the whole channel. Um, Y'all have probably, well, maybe you've seen us on a little react channel before. Probably not, though, so we'll probably end up linking our little videos that we make in this video. Who knows, we'll see. They'll probably be out in a while. What's up, guys? We have made it to the FBE lot, and we are gonna go do our little react shoots and hopefully we can show you like what the little sets look like or any behind the scenes things we can show you here. But here, here we, we go. go. Top secret stuff you're seeing right now. Doing the whole YouTuber react shoot. Yeah, this elevator kind of smells like a refrigerator. Bro. And the light's weird. It's like Ugh. creepy hotel core vibes. Yeah. I wonder, maybe we'll see a YouTuber in here. <gasps> Let's see. Who knows? Um, I mean, these are, these are simple. Bro. <clears throat> Oh, sorry about that. Sorry about, yeah, that. sorry about that. I legit can't do this. <laughs> <laughs> so I've been for about five years probably, and um, you were part of the creation of it, right? Yeah, I kind of started the. That was almost. I almost made it. Oh. Oh. <gasps> Stop. Oh, get me. Back. I'm gonna try it. Breaks the whole table. Bruh. <laughs> These fine motor skills, I've lost them Ooh. since a child. Damn it. So in conclusion, Noah sucks. <laughs> Alright, it's not for me. Let me try again. Props to anybody that can actually do these. Yeah, right. Alright, here we go. Two for two. What the can I even go three for three? How? Oh my god. It's almost too easy. Let me do it again. Comment below if you can do the kadamas. Oh, this thing is all twirled up. Uh oh. Let me fix this. It retire. I'm done. Good so, night. what's the secret? Be me. Swings have you got your left hand side. You guys have been here, right? Yes. Oh, yeah. The wall. Yep. And all the YouTubers. Hello. Hello. Hey, nice to see you again. Oh man, this lighting though. Hey. <laughs> I still am ugly. Hey, what did we just do? <laughs> yeah, so we just reacted um, with the Fine Bros React channel. Yeah, right here on the little YouTubers React set. Guys, we used to watch this show and now we're on these episodes. Man, crazy feeling, right? And I'm still not funny. That's crazy. Yet they invited us here. Hey, I'll take it. You know, the fact that we're even allowed to be here is pretty cool. Yeah, the fact that I have legs to walk is just a blessing. Yeah, life could be worse. Well, we'll keep you updated. Whoa, this is the YouTubers React wall. Whoa, look at me. You found yours? I signed there. There's Rhino. A while ago. Oh, and there's no boat right there. Hey, and then these are the celebrities that have came through to this space. Oh, they got, there's Doja Cat. Our favorite, James Charles. Bad baby's been here. Now I want to get on this wall. Yeah. Because what Lala? I thought she was an Instagrammer. Because you got the David Dobrik squad and stuff. Damn, they're and Gabe up there. Now wait a minute. How did this? What's the criteria for getting on? This How do I get on the celebrity list? What the? Who else is here? Is that Austin Mahone? Oh dang, that's crazy. Uh, oh, that, I'm friends with him. That's Edmund, Edwin. And that's the whole pretty much crew. I had his. I'll be up there. Yeah, we'll get up there. And then. They got all the YouTubers to sign and the teens react, elders react. This whole react wall is just cool. FBE. And now they kicked us out. BYE. Update. Ooh, Ryan has become a master at the Kadama. It's almost too easy to get Whoa. it. I get it like every time. Aww. Three in a row? It's like it's almost, it almost does it for you when you so spin it. Can, the key is a spin. Oh my goodness. That's too good. I really don't. <laughs> He's still going. Oh. Okay, now you have to keep going. <laughs> oh. 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 <laughs> right, what's the I don't think I could do another one. Thank you. For uh, uh, Bruno. Yeah. All right, so we just finished up our little video shoot with the React channel, and it went smooth. I think me and Noah lost our energy like halfway through yeah we were there for a solid three hours so 
we could, you know, you can only bring so much at the beginning and then your willpower kind of depletes throughout the day. And it's different, it's difficult because you know what you're saying is going to be broadcast to a bunch of new people. So it's, you know, I try to be myself, but at the same time, I don't want to be boring because the regular Ryan is pretty like mellow. I don't know. I was kind of in my own head that whole time. So hopefully the videos came out good. Sup team. So we just finished filming a video. I'm currently in pain because I ripped off my tattoo thing. Ah, ah, ooh. ooh, don't look at the nipple. That's so, um, but it's going to be a grizzly bear, but we had to take a break because I was in too much pain. So I'm going to finish the rest of it. Mm. later what y'all think comment down below yeah what y'all think of that little the half th tattoo third of the tattoo hey sheesh introducing brianna hi bow hey. <laughs> hello what's wow. up super happy to be here <laughs> yay yeah, so um, so we're like the best youtubers ever right to film it oh definitely i 10 out of 10 would do it again okay yeah, yeah she would um but no. yeah <laughs> 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 um yeah but it was Fun. We are just filming a skit right now. Well, we finished filming a skit right now, but because we're out in LA, we need different people to be in the videos. Like all the people that used to be in the videos, um, you know, not anymore. And now we have a new person. Hey. So like now she leaves tomorrow. Yeah, she lives in Florida. So. Damn. Why you gotta live across the country? I'm sorry. I want to uh, go to Texas. True. Oh really? Yeah. That's where you wanna live? Why Austin. Texas? I just love it there. I'm yeah. southern. Okay. Yee haw. Um, <laughs> yee yee. Yee yee. Same, same shit. Go get my camo jacket. Okay. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Oh shit. What's up, man? What's up, vlog? Uh oh. Netflix copyright. Ah, ah. Yeah, I'm just working to? on a, a new project, a new video, something mm. different for my channel. Project? New something. So I want to see, you know, I'm just trying to conceptualize right now and get the scenes ready and stuff. A little parody action. Uh, the behind the scenes, Rob behind the scenes. his grind. Ooh, getting his yeah, work done. Yeah, so just trying to get some new videos out for y'all. This is where you brainstorm? Brainstorm everything. All the magic happens right here. Oh, man. You would think it would happen here, but it doesn't. Just all right here. Oof, not on the bed. All the magic is right here. See the candle going? Oh, my goodness. The mahogany teakwood. Smell that? What the heck? Smell what? that. Let him smell it. Oh. What? What other what other guy you know got candles in a room? Come on, some guy candles only woke. for girls. Yeah, I think people aren't hip to how cool candles actually. Yeah, are. they're like, oh, candles only for girls. Da, da, da. Nah, y'all aren't woke and y'all are not open to just. Right, like we wear bras yeah. and too. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> all, right, all right, maybe not all that. Damn, Rob really got a cool room though. He got and water these. too. Drink, water. Drink lots of water. Hydro flash. Every day. Disco girl status. Hey. <laughs> People. Oh shoot! <laughs> yeah, I'm just walking out. Yeah. What's up, guys? So I want to show you guys something real quick, guys and girls. You know, I always was curious about that. Like, you always just say guys. You know, mm -hmm. guys doesn't really include girls, but it does. You know, if I say what's up, guys, a girl watching that probably wouldn't think anything of it. But you you wouldn't say what's up, girls. Any guy watching it would be like. What is this? Nonetheless, what's up everyone? Check out my room. Look at what I got going on. Look at these skateboards. These are newly installed. Um, turn the light on, get a little effect. Look at that. Ooh. 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 So we got the painting here. The Monopoly. Have y'all even seen this? The Monopoly guy and these bankers and stock people are mad at him for having a Monopoly. And look at the skateboards. What do you guys think of the decks? Supreme at the top. We have this one. This is funny. This is the, what's the book called? The name, come on, man, you know Green it. Green Giant? Bruh. Rob, you remember Jolly. this. Uh, green Sprout? Bruh. Uh, green? <laughs> You're green, kidding green me. Green Stop. What is it? It's the Giving Tree. The Giving Tree. You knew that. They gave me try to do that. Uh, okay. Um, and he's sticking his middle finger up at the kid and he's holding a skateboard. I thought that was pretty funny. Uh, another Supreme Deck. Uh, this one is a DGK. Whose hand do you think this is? At first glance. SpongeBob? What? <laughs> <laughs> All right, Rob's got the jokes tonight, everyone. Rob's got the jokes. All right, hold on, let me t dust off that camera. All right. I had a guess yeah. at first. Yeah, I know who that is. Yeah. Bart. Yes. I thought it was Winnie the Pooh. Oh. Right? But it's Bart. It has to be Bart. It is Bart Simpson. Well, what color is Winnie the Pooh's shirt? 
Red. Right? Yeah. It, that could be one of the... But he has mitts. Yeah, he has, like, short, stubby hand, like arms and hands. Yeah, that's, you're right. And that's Mickey Mouse, of course. So, passing... How do you know it's not... It could be Goofy. And Rob will be making less and less appearances in the vlogs. <laughs> <laughs> I don't smoke. I never have. I never will. Um, anyone watching this, I suggest... You try to stay away from it. I know that a lot of people do it to heal themselves, and I'm all for the legalization of marijuana and all that stuff, but me personally, I don't have any dark demons that I need to escape from, from this reality, so I like being like in tune and sharp. This I wanna get you guys' opinion on. This is a controversial artistic piece. It's a Supreme skateboard done by some artist, I don't remember his name. I saw it and it spoke to me because I was just like, this is, what, like, what the hell is going on here? It's kids and they're trick-or-treating. It's funny because it was just Halloween yesterday. They're trick-or-treating and they dress up as Hitler and like I think that's either Saddam Hussein or Bin Laden. Uh, this is a black kid in a KKK outfit. A white kid with a black face pimp outfit. A clown that said Jesus Christ and some sort of like gay thing. Um, what do y'all make of this? Like what do you think the meaning is? Rob, what do you think? So, what I think Here's the thing, when you're kids, like when you're a child, there's like no filters basically, right? Uh -huh. So it's like when you're a kid, you don't really have that judgment on people because you don't really understand. So it's like, I'm just a kid and I want to dress up whoever, but it's like, but then it can mean something like he's in the front. So it's like, does that mean something? I feel like you're onto something because yes, kids, when they see stuff, everything's innocent for them. Nothing, they can't attach much meaning to things because They'll dress up like that guy. They don't know who that guy is. Mm. He's just a guy with a mustache. Yeah. Ah, like funny yeah. jokes. Um, oh, I'm going to paint my face brown. Ah. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if you can get away with that one. <laughs> yeah, maybe just the innocence of kids or something, mm -hmm. right? But then again, there's adults with them, and they know. Here's my analysis. Ready for this? Stay with me. This was made, I believe, in 2008. And life and society then was a lot different than it was now. You know, people with their senses, people are sensitive about stuff now. I think this is saying that people in today's society, today meaning what, the 2008, they don't care about things as much and society is being led in a wrong direction of people being insensitive of things that they should care about. Um, so like, you've got a kid, oh, Hitler, like, uh. People care so little about being respectful that they'll go as far as to dress up as something so terrible as a terrorist or Hitler. Oh, a black kid would even dress up in KKK as a joke because like, ha ha, who cares? And his black dad is the one leading him walking. And then the clown, what does the clown represent? I feel like the clown is what represents being respectful and normal. He's not having fun. He's the only one that's not having a good time. And he's in the back. And he's in the back and he's the normal one. So being cool and, and like normal and politically correct or whatever is not cool anymore. Um, and, and people are just insensitive nowadays. Um, does that make sense? Am Ooh, I, I, think, I think you're getting somewhere. You think that that makes yeah. I'm kind of going, these are multiple theories kind of all tied in one. Because um, at first you see, all right, these are all bad, like blackface, KKK, blah. But then you have Jesus and like a, a gay, I don't know what to call that. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't know what that term is. I think it's, it's making some sort of statement about society and how people are insensitive to things. And nowadays, people are too sensitive, right? Like mm -hmm. that's what I feel like happens on Twitter a lot is everyone gets offended by everything. But maybe there are some people who society also needs to maybe take some more care in certain things, dealing with things like racism, terrorism, uh, uh, s religious beliefs and uh, gay rights and stuff. Like maybe people do need to take that a little bit more serious. Uh, I don't know. We'll put it in the comments what you guys think. I don't know, it's kind of a deep thing, but whatever. Rhino's here, Rhino Collection. I, you guys should send me rhinos, like uh, from the PO box. We'll put that in the description. We have a PO box. Send me a bunch of rhinos that I can put here, and I'll and I'll make them not not too big, but like so I can have a whole collection. I think that'd be cool. You guys can see that in the vlogs. Hat collection. Boom. 
You know, we got all the hats looking all good. Room coming together. Uh, Rob admitted that I have the best room out of everyone. Uh, shout out to the Merle, twin, Merle Twins uh, merch. I'm wearing that right now. Heh. I think that's pretty funny. But yeah. What's so, Snow up to? So guys, just bought the new fake Louis sweatpants. Oh. Billy like Eilish has them though, so it doesn't matter if they're fake, they're still fresh. I mean, feel this. You guys, you feel it? And, and, let's, yeah. and let's not even use the word fake, you know? Uh, um, Artistic. Different. It's fabricated. No. Uh, um, it's, uh, yeah. And then it's not fake. It's like, because fake. They're real. <laughs> they're obviously real these paint. These are fake too, but I found these. Kid Boo wore these in like a video yeah. once. All right, these are hard. You wouldn't even yeah. know that these are. Yeah. See, because right here, this guy, he makes customs for Billie Eilish, so I found the website that he does them for. Yeah. Wow. 100,000 likes. I'll drop the link. <laughs> yeah, I better run this video up. Yeah, man. So, Fresh. Just trying out some new stuff. And it's like, end of the day, nobody's going to say, hey, those are fake. And if they are, I'm like, yeah. I can't, I, can't, I can't afford the real ones. <laughs> so yeah, we better go out to City Walk. All dripped out just to take a picture specifically at City Walk, so that's how it goes. Got these new shoes, and they're called Shoes. Yeah. Get that. Never heard of that brand. Shoes. Shoes. Then I got some of these fake Louis Vuitton sweatpants, sweatshirts too. But again, Billie Eilish was wearing them. So if she's rocking the fake in front of the world, she's saying like, you know, just go, go within your price range. And... 80 bucks. Yeah, the Billie Eilish price range is definitely cheap. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> but like if I match these with like real Gucci or Louis, who's going to question me? True. Eh. And you know that I think about that like... And most people don't even shop these clothes, so they don't know what real is. And like who cares what you're like... Hey, it, these are comfortable. Imagine that a, a multi-million millionaire star performer, if she wears something, it's automatically cool. Yeah. So who's to say you can't wear something and make it cool? That's like, what we were saying like the other day, if Drake started wearing Skechers all year, I'm sure half the world would start wearing Skechers. If, no, like if Justin Bieber had Skechers, I'm like, those are hard. Yeah, and he, he could be the ugliest colorway. I'm gonna be like, I could rock those. Uh -huh, exactly, so I mean, I mean, look at Rob. Rob's getting ready right now. I mean, look at Rob with these trash ass uh, joggers. Um, <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> Why you gotta play like, like, like look at these, super cheap, <laughs> probably thrift store, <laughs> maybe, no more than 15 bucks. <laughs> and <laughs> I actually really like these. <laughs> I spent my whole check. I spent my whole check on these pants. <laughs> like you could tell, he probably thrifted them, probably something yeah. cheap, bad quality. Worn and out. even look at the socks. Worn out socks. <laughs> um. I'm gonna just say, <laughs> you guys have fun at City Walk. <laughs> and here's the thing. It's like anybody can just say stuff to me, but like I don't care. So, exactly. and that's the whole thing about style. We talked about this before already. Nobody yeah. Person, Nobody person. can tell me anything. Those pants are too cheap. Why would you wear the cheap? Let me see. And then look at me. I'm gonna wear them anyway. You know what? I'm gonna put on a cheap outfit. First off, I I don't even know what I'm wearing right now. I think the sweatshirt's gotta stay on though. That's like fresh. Oh, you like this? Is that who's merch? Yeah, how cold is it? Ooh. It's getting cold now. Pretty cold out now. Let me, let's take a temperature yeah, check. Um, Temp check. Y'all see the no boats Whoa, first haircut? Whoa, guys. What the? I might have to just go bald. Bro, that I need more annoying. haircut videos. More haircut videos. Here we go. Rob, you gotta get one next. Yup, I'm next. It's kind of loop. Actually, not that bad. It's like not cold at all. Here, yeah. So maybe not a hoodie. Um, all right, cheap outfit. Here we go. Here Step we go. one. But now, what is the steps to putting together cheap outfit? Do you just kind of pick whatever or? Um, Because most of my closet is drip city. So oh, it's true. like. Um, just kidding. I have a lot of thrift clothes and stuff. Let's do this. Here we go. What is the cheapest, cheapest stuff I have in here? Um, let's like, look at some of the shirts. kind of hard. <laughs> I'm like, oh, damn, this is all expensive. Ryan's favorite color has got to be black. Yeah. Got black shirts for days. Do we, this is a whole closet tour. Maybe whoa, just... Whoa, whoa, save that one for... How about I'll just close the door, and then you'll come out, drip down in cheap outfit. There you go. <laughs> Nothing crazy. Um, Can I explain your outfit? This is a um, vintage, vintage. It's an older uh, Adidas shirt that I got at Buffalo Exchange, Rob. Huh? Uh, Buffalo Exchange, I got this shirt. Buffalo Exchange. I got this at Buffalo Exchange too. Dude, thrift boys. Whoa. Well, those are both fresh. So this wow. is kind of big baggy, it's just nothing crazy, I'm trying to be comfortable tonight. We got the Dirty Vans, 45 bucks. Um, Lovely Surf socks. Uh, that's Mando. Those are priceless. But, uh, PacSun joggers. And this was what? Like, 
ten dollars or something. Mm. And then a little LA hat, because you know I'm from LA. Psych. Right from Maryland. But uh, let's get out of here. Cool. Let's get it. Here we go. Change of plans. I actually changed. I just changed the shirt. Um, Why was that? I was feeling the black shirt. It was speaking to me. Um, I think that white shirt would be better for a more summer vibe. But it's fall, so I'm trying to keep it. And it's gonna be nighttime too. So I'm just trying to keep like it chill, you know. Black, slimming, you know, rob a breeze. Not really. <laughs> I like his other fit better, but. Huh. Rob's, what you still, gonna do? Rob's still tight about my funny roast that I made on his joggers. He can't take a joke. Isn't They're that actually, crazy? Um, cargo pants. Oh, not really? Joggers. Okay, well, you know what? You're uncultured. <clears throat> you wouldn't know, it's all right. These right here, those are more of joggers. One these. second. Uh, Stop outside real quick. Talk to me real quick. I'm here. You want to wrestle? Let's go. Ryan thinks he can beat me up, so I gotta show him. Oh god, Rob and Ryan are about to wrestle. This is better than a Logan Paul KSI. Okay. One so, big. What I would do normally, I, I can see I can see Rob's weak spot already, his back foot. So what I would probably do <laughs> instantly, I would I would lunge this way. Oh, that's and, a, that's an easy toss. <laughs> Oh, Wait a I think the Uber's here. Pin. Let me just teach you a couple of wrestling moves. Okay. Okay. So we'll start with the stance right here. I wrestled for like 14 years of my life, so. Ooh. They didn't, they didn't even know that. It's okay, though. So we're going to start here. Okay. Nice little stance. So we're going to move around. You can take a couple of this way. Okay. This is what's going to be called a double leg shoot. Okay. So we're going to come here. I uh, sometimes I like to do the distraction. Like I come up here, I could like either clap, and you'll blink. And by the time you blink, I'm already down there. Oh shit! So you come in, you want to shoot straight to the legs up here, and you want to drive with the head, and then that's when I can just take you down. Let's see. I don't want to hurt him right now. Well, I see. What I go back to that position? Okay. Because this is what I learned at uh, Texas Tech when I wrestled there. Um, so you so came I'm in here. and you're doing this. And guys, this is just a tip, wrestling tip. I would probably then lock here. I would create a lock, worst move you can do. And then I would, this I would, no WWE. I would flip him 360. I would completely flip his whole torso and land on the bed like this and win. That wouldn't even happen. I think the Uber's here. Comment below who you think would have won if they actually wrestled. Rob or Ryan? To the Uber we go. Uh, you mind if I scoot the chair back? Yeah. Uh. <laughs> right. Oh, it's gonna be packed, packed. Can we pack tonight? Just roll, oh, yeah. We just got here. Um, I think this is the last day of Horror Nights too, so Damn. people are gonna be here. Oh, Horror Nights is still a thing? Yeah, yeah, it's, it's still on tonight. I saw people dressing, like girls on Instagram, still dressing up and it, on November 1st. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure there's a lot of parties this weekend, but excited excited to come. This is your first time here? First time, for, I'm a City Walk virgin. Bruh. City Walk, hey, what's the move? Oh, look, they got Cinnabon. Let's get it. So this is cool. Um, my main goal was to get ice cream, so I won't be satisfied until I get that. But Bruh. I like this look. Our gorilla. Um, yeah, and we had a little, nice little fan love. But yeah, having a good time. Uh, yeah. And then could I have a uh, a large cup of the uh, what's it called? Cookies and cream. Uh, the rainbow sprinkles on it. I will get the berry berry extraordinary sorbet two scoops of that please oh uh, yeah that'll be fine that's it for me I donate the whole thing I didn't even pay it <laughs> I might just run <laughs> yeah got the ice cream oh, yeah. bro with the circle sprinkles circle sprinkles are better than are better than regular sprinkles I'm telling you if you don't believe me try yourself I got the see I'm a simple guy just the sherbet and you know, the dairy doesn't really sit well in my stomach, so. I wonder about how my card was declined. Oh. Yeah, I, I, look. You're a five, you have, you have five million I subscribers, have, and your card gets declined. Hey kids, make sure you have money on your card before you go and embarrass it's yourself. It's so dark right now, because oh, of the light. Is.
So Rob, why is it the ice cream that you got like worked better through your system than other ice cream? See, because this is a ice based, water based. Ah. So it's more like a it's a sh sherbet sorbet. Okay. How do you how do you say it? I don't know how to even say it. <laughs> is it is, are those two different words? I don't even know. Sherbet sorbet. But uh, yeah, this is better because I don't think it contains milk. So can you have you can have Rita's too? What? Rita's ice cream? Can you read that? Rita's. What's that? It's like ice. You know what Rita's is? Oh, no, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, I can have Rita's. You can have Rita's. Okay. Yeah, just anything that contains milk, not good. Not good. That not is uh, very scary for me. Ooh. Meanwhile, Ryan over here got a whole extra cup of sprinkles. You have to because I said, I said, sir, can I get the rainbow sprinkles? This man went, this is legit how, many, how much he gave me. He was like, sure. Bro. So I got the full cup so I could keep pouring it on there as I eat it. What's up, y'all? I already finished my ice cream. Probably been like two and a half minutes. I just wanted to do a little debate in the comments. Just comment below if you're a fast eater or a slow eater. I, I don't, don't know have... anybody that eats faster than Noah. He legit yeah, inhales right. his food. And I'm like, bro, we just ordered that. <laughs> bro, I be eating appetizers the second they touch my table. Any food, it's gone right away. So I just want to know, are you guys fast eaters or slow eaters? Comment down below. Yeah. Meanwhile, I'm the literal slowest eater on the planet. It doesn't get slower than Ryan. People be like, people be like, I'm slow eater too. And then they're done before me. You eating. like to like two specifically? Big pause, but like, yeah. it's hard for me to swallow. What the fuck? Okay. You know? I think that's okay as a guy. It's just, I don't know. I like to chew my food a lot before I swallow it. Let us know down there. Fast eater, slow eater. I want to see. Uh, I, mean, you, oh, you, I like you, what I You seen the videos? Yeah, bro, Appreciate always. It. Favorite one? Sure. Anything? I always, bro. They're all good. Yeah. <laughs> Funny as guy. <laughs> You get a pick. Are you a slow eater or a fast eater? Me, uh, I'm a slow eater. Bro. I like to take my time. No, that's it right there. Um, yeah, I'll take a picture. Let's do it. I want to. Cool. Yeah. Got it. All right, bro. Appreciate it. All right, take care, bro. What's your name? Man? Caleb. Nice to meet you, bro. We'll stand up. Oh, we all sit down. Which one do you think? Sit down. Stand up. Let's sit down. Sit down. What the? <laughs> I like the jacket, man. Thank you. Man. Cool. Yeah, we always take a couple. I don't know. Just, yeah, nice right. meeting you. Thank you so much, bro. Appreciate you. Yeah, man. Nice meeting you, bro. Appreciate it. Have a great day. Guys, what I tell you, it's been about 10 minutes and Ryan is still eating his ice cream. Mm -hmm. He's not even made a dent. <laughs> and he's full. <laughs> <laughs> and you're done, right? I've been done. Flavor. I like to appreciate the flavor. Ah, okay. You know, part of being alive is just eating. You eat like for a fourth of your lifespan. You might as well enjoy it. I feel like a like a hospital patient. <laughs> so do you do you feel different after this or like? Yeah, you feel more alert. You feel more entertained. Refreshing, harmonizing, elevating. Wow. Are you turning up the oxygen? What does it do? So these are different different, different flavors. Oh, oh, what are we like talking about? Like oh, a candy oh. Yeah. Some and some oh, like candy cane. Oh, okay. Ooh. Uh, uh, we're from Maryland. Did yeah. a whole workout. You recorded it? Yeah. Yeah, we just moved here a month ago, though. This is the fun. <laughs> it's fun. We just, we're in Burbank, so we're like right here. Okay. But it's definitely nice. Nice area. What are we even doing? Right? <laughs> Look at Ryan over here. He's getting pampered. This is so oh, and I can get kind of ticklish, low key. Uh. Wow. Oh, this is oh. YouTuber lifestyle, man. This is what you do. You know, <laughs> I might come here every day this week. <laughs> come here, get some oxygen, get some play with oxygen. You guys are open five days a week? Seven days a week. Oh, even better. Say less. Oh, oh say, say less. less. But this but, might be the new spot. Yeah. Abby boy up now. Oh, this is nice. How do you feel? Ooh, it felt good. I think this is exactly what I needed, so. You've been stressed out, haven't you? Yeah, I've been, a, I've been <laughs> you pretty stressed. You had a whole video in one day, right? Yeah, one day, brand new video, but uh, essentially we just walked by here and saw there was flavored air, and it was like, well, you need to do that, obviously. So right now I have my stuff all gassing me up. These are all on 100. Giving me invigorating, cheering, uplifting, refreshing, cooling, invigorating, sensual, exotic. So... Apparently supposed to breathe better or something. I don't know. Bruh. So now we getting this water massage, bro. I do not know what I'm doing. Didn't know we're getting ourselves into this tonight. 
<laughs> Face down. Here I go. Into the chamber. Will I come out? Who knows? Ah. Holy cow. So what happens if I'm like, want to get the hell out of this thing? You hold this one. I just press that? Hold it. Oh, hold it. Okay. <laughs> so my face is down in here? Yeah. Holy. Brian's Holy hell. Yeah. This is probably not for people who are claustrophobic. Hold on now. <laughs> what the heck? Man getting sprayed with water. You're next, boy. I'm ready for this. Ah! Oh, it's starting. All right, guys, I'm about to try it out too. Here we go. How are you done already? Uh, I just popped out. Oh, how do I pop out? How long is it? You still have a left in minute. I'm ready to go. <laughs> you just click that. <laughs> I'm ready. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I'm trapped in here. And you can't get out. How'd you feel? Great, man, that water pressure was right. crazy. Yeah. I Oh, water <laughs> Me personally, it got to my feet. I was like, ooh, ooh. <laughs> I was, every, it's take like that. From the feet to my thighs, it was hard for me. But yeah. the back, head, everything was good. I'm feeling good. Rob enjoyed that. Yeah. I'm trying to What's going on over here? Breaking down all the muscle tissue. Yeah, it is the, the, the back massage. Whoa. Your voice. I sound like T Pain. Oh my God. Let's oh, get one, two hours. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I feel good. edit like for two, three minutes. Yeah, I'm editing all day. <laughs> oh man, wow, this is great. I need this. Ooh. Ooh. I still feel like I'm vibrating. Yeah. Because my body doesn't know what's happening right now. It just feels all these things touching, so. Does it, can this go on your forearm and stuff too? Yeah. Oh wow, ooh, yeah, I, I, I need this. I can you tell where my body is. <laughs> my father there. <laughs> ooh. Yeah. Buy one of these? Yeah, we like, should. Straight up. Do you have do you sell these here or no? Oh. You you got the right customers because we're tries, gonna buy <laughs> tries everything out. How on much you? are the massage machines? <laughs> yeah. Hear it in the voice. Hit a note, hit a high note. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, this is nice. Oh, <laughs> yo, could you be sitting down all the time? <laughs> all the time. Oh, yeah. You seen the videos? Yeah. What's your name? Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, <laughs> yeah. What's up, dude? Well, you also oh, have here. So we're at that bar. Do you want to get a picture or something? Yeah. Oh, wait. Oh, my gosh. You're oh. YouTubers. TikToker. Yeah. yeah. Wait, no. Yeah. Yeah. I, uh, I used to do Vine. It's dead. Chilling. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, where's yeah, normal? Hold on one second. <laughs> yeah, bro, appreciate it. Thanks. Okay, so um, Noah's walking out of the store and he failed to mention that it was six hundred dollars the check when we left there, and I was like, Noah, first off, why the hell did you <laughs> let him ring it up at six hundred dollars? Second off, what was six hundred dollars? The air? What was that? So, the the massage gun that we bought was. Let's see, Noah. Let's have Noah get a receipt. <laughs> so apparently the massage gun we bought was four hundred dollars. <laughs> huh? Four hundo for this? Oh hell nah. They, not. They they taxing. City walk. Go. Uh, we fell for the tourist trap. <laughs> yeah. That's what happened. Yeah. They didn't even tell us the price or nothing. Yeah. 
He said, oh, they're YouTubers. There's no problem. Meanwhile, my bank's gonna call me tomorrow. Did you mean to make this purchase last night? Yeah. We gotta start monetizing on the vlog channel. <laughs> Y'all better watch all these ads. <laughs> yeah, really. Where are we at right now? Look, Cinnabon. Um, had, just had ice cream, and now I want a sweet Cinnabon. Haven't ate any dinner. Just, this is, this is the diet of a 22 year old. Hey, my body can take the punishment for now. That's why I can do stuff like this. And you're ready, you're up. Here we go. <laughs> uh, can I get one big Cinnabon and one mini Cinnabon? And do you guys have water? Secured the bag. Time to eat. Time to feast. Always good vibes here at City Walk. I think that's why I like coming here is because like the atmosphere is cool. You got the lights. You got the people. You got the Cinnabon. Bruh. Oh. Look at this. Oh. Oh my god. Bro, Noah hasn't ate anything. Bro. <laughs> I, I don't think that's, that's, that's healthy. When you don't eat poop, your brain tells you fatty. Fatty sugars. Anything that's unhealthy. Like I want all chips, dessert, hot dogs, hamburgers. And this is what I've chosen to get. And we, we're trying to like get on this health kick and like go to the gym and stuff. And it's like, it's, you know, this is our cheat day though. Yeah. This is our cheat day. Friday, you Friday have night to, with the boys. You have to have one cheat day. Exactly. And this is it. So it's like, you know, you won't be seeing us so eating. There, actually, stuff. If you eat a whole bunch of clean food, aren't there some benefits to some of the bad food? Like you need certain types of things from it. I don't know the specific terms. I'm not a dietist, nutritionist. Yeah, so Ryan's at the store right now getting something. And we're chilling. We're probably gonna be heading out soon, I think. Yeah, we're pretty much done. Pretty much done here for today, and then back to the apartment. <laughs> what in the f One, two, three. What? Sorry, sorry, I'm good. Look at it. You're getting DMing us, bro. So we're back. Um, I'm the biggest Raiders fan on the planet. Raiders! Who? Favorite player? Williams. What's his first name? Hey. Come on, you're a big fan. Yeah. Um. Someone, someone, someone's texting me right now. Terrell Williams. Impressive. Yeah. <laughs> I know my stuff. I know my stuff. But yeah, we. I went to the little jersey store, and I was like, oh, the, I mean, the Raiders. Like, look, I know nothing about football. <clears throat> like, let's be honest. I, I'm, we're from Maryland, so like Redskins. Like, I love the Redskins. I guess that's my team. But do I like the Redskins colors? No. I wish the Redskins were black and silver and white that'd be a cooler color scheme so yeah i just got this strictly because my favorite number is 17 and this is 16 and my middle name is william and this is williams so i couldn't not get it and this, and then this guy was like oh it's a Terrell williams jersey i've never seen that before and then i like was like yeah like i don't know what to say to these sports people because like they care about sport i just can't imagine caring it, about it that much when you're not even on the team you know like, Rob, do you care about what sports are you caring about right now? None. I'm not. Because we live, like, I don't watch sports like that. Like, I can't invest my time and my energy into, oh, player number this. Oh, he's hurt this week. So, I don't. Like, the teams, like, yeah, I'll watch it, like, if it's on, but I cannot keep up with it. That's just me. Um, but, yeah. And even me as a, uh, like, big soccer fan. Uh, I used to, not, I can't even say I used to be like that. Like, when you support a team, you support them, you mm -hmm. know the players, ah! Oh. I, but, again, I can't be so invested in it that I'm like... And if it's cool, and if you are, it's that's cool. Yeah, it's a, it's it's a, a, hobby, it's a hobby people. Yeah. My hobby is just like, what I do, like YouTube. Mm -hmm. I'm more involved in that. Like, I feel like even Players who play for these sports teams don't even care that much about their teams because they'd be switching every like year. Yeah. Whereas, yo, you want Terrell Williams? Boo! I hate and whatever like, team is gonna pay them the most is what team they're gonna be on. Exactly. Right? But yet the fans be like, oh, you guys suck. Oh, this team sucks, dude. And people get in actual fights. Yes. Because you support this team and this. I'm like, huh? Yet the players that actually play that actually are good and it's their life, they be switching all the time. I don't know. I don't get it. My other two cops, because I'm a huge, just, I'm a hat guy. So I got another one of these Dodgers, um, just simple black hat. Just simple, just cool. I like the little white and black. Yeah. And then little Carhartt uh, Dodgers collab. 
Uh, let's see. Maybe the little stickers and stuff. Durable. You see the tag? So, durable. And that's the end of the vlog. We got a lot of footage. <laughs> I guess we'll see how much footage we have. Um, so, you know me, big LA guy. I'll, I'll, I'll fix this later. Uh, closing words from Rob? Closing words? Make sure you work hard, but have fun too. <laughs> I like that. And don't overspend on stuff. Um, but you can buy cool stuff like us. Just don't buy massagers that are four hundred dollars. Noah, um, we're gonna get good use out of it. I'll tell you that. We will have no pain after all our workouts. Our muscles will be good. Our muscles will be good. Yeah. I shouldn't have paid that much. And I just bought a massager that does the same job. But hey, who knows? All in all, make sure you guys subscribe to the YouTube channel. Uh, follow the gang on Twitter. I mean, not on Twitter. Or on Twitter if they want. I would say Instagram. Instagram? <laughs> <laughs> but we tweet. Sometimes. Sometimes we tweet. But that's like, if you're really a true fan, then you'll follow us on Twitter. But like, Instagram is like... Cool. We don't have any followers on Twitter. So if you guys do want to follow us, those will be popped up. I have no followers on Twitter or Instagram. So it's like, I would appreciate like both. But um, it's, it's okay. It's cool. Okay. But if you guys watch this vlog, go to Rob's Instagram and say, I love you, Rob. Or give him a heart emoji. Oh, I would appreciate that. I would sleep with a smile on. So it's like. Just send him the heart emoji to let you know that, you, to let him know that you watch this vlog all the way to the end and that you love him and support him. No, because there's a lot of people out there that are like, I hate Rob. I hate Rob. Uh, <laughs> take him out of the. And he goes through so much. Like. And I'm like over here, like, oh, I thought it was. Part of the game. <laughs> I thought I was. He's like, I live with her. <laughs> Where am I supposed to go? Uh, um, love is greater than hate. Facts. And I want to see something. How many comments can you get on your IG of hearts? Probably not a lot, but we'll see. Everyone watching this, please, it only takes a little bit of time out of your day to go and do that. <laughs> to just help this child. <laughs> That's it. We'll catch you guys on the next video. Peace out. Um, LA. <laughs> ah! Oh!